Hello everyone, I am Sakteshwari Ramachandran. I love to conquer my fear, ignorance and misconceptions. I hope you also have an inclination towards conquering something abstract or concrete. Well, it is involved in a simple task. Imagine that you are here as a student receiving your formal primary education and that I am your language teacher reflecting faithfully the pattern and practice designed by an authentic education system. Well, I teach you all the important components of language, but only with the passing reference of verb. All the exercises and the tests that I give you do not have space for verb. After you being trained so, if I flash a picture of this girl and ask you to write a few relevant words, what would you write? You will write quite a few words, but obviously not the word jump because you wouldn't have noticed it. It is not that you don't know the word, rather you wouldn't have felt the urge to express it. Why? Negligence. It's because of the negligence of verb here. So negligence has a crucial role in our lives. It had its crucial role in the history of the making of Chile too. The Spanish and the Portuguese invaded South America, the Caribbean islands and Mexico in the 16th century. The Spaniard Pedro de Almagro was very important in establishing the Spanish Empire in Peru and in the western part of South America. He was able to make his way to Chile, but his mission of establishing a city over there was a complete failure. After him came Pedro de Valdivia. He undertook an expedition towards conquering Chile. After so many trials and tribulation, he was successful in founding the city of Santiago on February 12, 1541. After that, he ruled the land and the people. Well, everything is fine with the making of Chile, but what about that woman who stood by him throughout the hardships of his journey and life? She was Ines Suarez. She played an important role as that of Valdivia in establishing the Spanish Empire in Chile. But her role was completely neglected by the historians. The chroniclers of her time did register her accomplishments, but in due course, the historians either removed her name from history or just made a mention of her name as the mistress of Valdivia, completely forgetting her tactfulness, faithfulness, bravery and compassion. Of course, Valdivia was in her heart, but Chile was her heartbeat. She was that one person who was responsible for founding a community in Santiago, feeding the sick people and poor people, treating them all, trading with the native ones and ultimately evolving as a successful empress. It is quite unfortunate that her glory was confined within her time period. This neglected history has become the genesis of three important novels, the latest being Isabel Allende's Innes of My Soul. History teaches us many things. Truth is unraveled only to those who have the courage to question whatever have been taught. So, seek truth by conquering negligence. Thank you.